So today I woke up and realised that it is 21 years that we have been in existence in some form supporting those with neuroendocrine cancer. And I really do think that that warrants a massive shout out, thank you to everybody who's been involved in developing this organisation um, and helping us to do what we so passionately believe in. To all of those healthcare professionals who have driven specialised services and expert clinics. To all of our trustees who have helped drive Neuroendocrine Cancer UK, especially Peter Gwilliam, who has been around since the, its inception 21 years ago um, and is still with me today as the chair of our trustee board. To all of you who have given your time and energy to raising awareness or to raising funds or to volunteer to run NATA groups um, or to have a stall or to have a stand. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. And to all of the staff at NCUK, um, there are a few of us now, although we still only have two full-time members of staff, but each and every one of you I know is passionate about making a difference. And you need that passion to work in this space. But I guess ultimately, none of this matters um, unless we are improving the lives of those with neuroendocrine cancer. So I just want to promise any of you who have been diagnosed with neuroendocrine cancer that we will keep trying and we will keep pushing for the best possible care and treatment for each and every one of you.